Well, this weekend is looking nice and hot for all you guys that are planning to go to the pool. It's going to be perfect weather for that. No rain in sight. Warming up, ridge dries us out. That pretty much sums up the first two headlines. Quiet weather this weekend. Not going to see too much action with that, but beautiful conditions going into the rest of the week. But as we go into where we were today, well, today we reached 94 degrees. That's well above average. Uh, 91 is where we're supposed to be. 52 was this morning. A little cooler this morning to say we're in May, transitioning into June. And temperatures coming down fairly nice across the United States. 70s near the southeast, 77 here. Seeing 60s and 50s through the plains and portions of the Midwest. Where they've been getting some active showers and storms. And that low pressure system, included low, continue to dump some showers into the Ohio Valley some storms along that warm front boundary. That cold front that came through our region has stalled in between Alabama and Mississippi, but still seeing some influence behind there. They'll continue to see some active weather going into tonight. Winds will be picking up. We'll see a shift eventually going into this weekend. We'll be on the downhill of another trough that's going to um, form over the Rockies the next couple days and make winds gust for us into Saturday into Sunday. Getting gusty around 20 to 35 miles per hour, possibly Monday, keeping on that. And then Tuesday, getting another chance to see that as well ahead of another system where models may hint, maybe some showers, but I'm going to wait to see how things get in better agreement. But triple digits is what we're going to see. Hot weather in the forecast, definitely time to hit the pool and make sure you wear that sunscreen. Monday, maybe the best day as well. Cooler Tuesday, thanks to some cloud cover. Then we'll see things get a little more cooler. These models hinted maybe a shower looking best for our eastern counties at this moment. Not so much widespread across the Counter Valley, but we'll take whatever rain we can get. And then keeping this model, keeping a little more weather pattern for Thursday. We'll keep an eye on it through the weekend to see if anything changes because I'm not quite buying that just yet. But hot weather on the way, drink plenty of water. If you're going to the pool, wear your sunscreen. Remember to reapply it. Sometimes we forget to do that. And remember to check the back seat for your pets and loved ones before you get out of the car. Traveling this weekend, be safe on the road. Condition is going to be great. Seeing temperatures in the hundreds, 90s for most of us, a little cooler in Galveston, Texas, along the coast. But if you're going Sunday, getting a little later, you're going to have a great day as well. Now, something you can do going into tomorrow at 9 p.m., if you go down to the Cactus Hotel in between Miss Hattie's, that parking lot, they're showing a movie, Disney movie, Luca, a great movie to see with the family and friends. There will be concessions out. This is how your temperature is going to pan out throughout the night. It's going to be a little warmer, so definitely be prepared for that to maybe bring your water or your ice water. And then as we get to 9, movie time, 88 degrees by 10. When things are wrapping up, it'll still be in the lower 80s. Going into tonight, temperatures will drop down into 62 degrees. Thanks to those winds being somewhat light, allowing good radiational cooling tonight. Same thing for tomorrow. Winds won't be as heavy and gusty. We'll definitely be seeing hundreds, possibly, maybe upper 90s. Don't be surprised. It's going to be pretty hot into the next day. Now, planning out tomorrow, well, your package forecast. If you're getting some packages, it's going to be great weather. If you're delivering them, great weather. It's going to be hot, though, if you plan to do that going into the afternoon hours the next seven days. Well, heat is on the way, continuing into the Contro Valley. Overall, no rain in sight just yet. Keeping an eye on that next system may cool us off a little bit Wednesday to Thursday, but a little too early to tell. We'll keep you informed here at KSN News.